my name is Ricky Allen. I'm the Scoutmaster of Troop 155 here at Fort Knox, Kentucky. Um, I've been the Scoutmaster here for going on a little bit over two years now. Um, upon me leaving theater on my last deployment, I met up with the committee chair who we served together in South Korea in Boy Scouts together. And she said the troop was looking for a Scoutmaster and I volunteered like a, like a good Scout leader should. In South Korea, uh, my son and I was on one of the concerns. We was walking and he happened to see we saw a father and son in a Scout uniform. And my son let me know that he's always interested in joining scouting, which was a delight and baffled me since I never mentioned my past scouting career with him. So uh, we located the local troop, which is Troop 81, and then um, I quickly became assistant scoutmaster of that troop. Now, during that time in South Korea, we did a lot of activities. I mean, due to the location and being our way from country in Oconus, we, was, we had the luxury of having two camping trips minimum a month. When we go hiking or camping, it's not just the scouts out there. You got people ranging from the age of three and four, well up into their 80s, hiking with you. Um, so in South Korea, it's, it's easier to get the scouts out and about doing scout things. Military children are different than most because they're used to being uprooted, relocated, and have to make friends on each stop that their parents go through as they go through their career. Um, but one thing that that brings to the table is the fact that you got a lot of diversity. You might have a scout that's maybe been in the program maybe two or three years, but because they've been in different states, different countries, they bring a different thought process or different ideals to the table, which greatly enhanced the idea of a scout-led program. Some scouts, they start off slow, they might spend a long time at scout or tenderfoot, then all of a sudden they get an aha moment and they catch up. My advice is just keep going and enjoy the experience. My approach to scouting is simple. Um, I believe scouting isn't about achieving Eagle Scout. It's about enjoying the adventure, learning something, getting stuff from each step that will make them a better citizen later on in life and to introduce them to what they can and cannot do in life on a positive level. 